for images all listed here like this. Remember, an image is an inline tag. It's not block level. And that's why when we uh, put them all in, they just come right after the other for as long as the window is. But it's not a very beautiful or organized gallery in the way that it's not centered and it kind of tiles differently. So we're going to add a few tags to help it out. And it'll be over here on our styles. Remember, we named this um, div with a class of gallery. So we'll create a gallery class and dot gallery. And the first thing we'll say, as we did in the navigation, is display flex. Oof. There we go. And then we're going to say flex direction. We're going to tell it to be a row direction. I'll show you how that differs if you choose column. Flex direction. And I'm going to choose row, but as you can tell, you can choose column. Let me choose that, and we'll change it to column in a second. Um, we're going to tell it to wrap. We want the flex wrapping process to happen. You can see here you can choose no wrap, but we're going to choose wrap. We'll play with these in a minute. Now, just like we did with the navigation, we'll choose justify content and center. And let's see. I think between this blue line here and the images, we should have a little space. So I'll do a margin top of uh, 50 px. All right, let's see what we have so far. So a couple of things have changed. It's now centered nicely, and it has that gap at the top. And as I close it, you'll be able to see 